All right, so we have another hands-on exercise here. Hands-on exercise number five. Make sure that you go do this. Go do it. Go do it, baby. Go do it. <laughs> go do it before I show you the solution. That's how you learn to program. You learn to ride a bike by riding the bike, not by watching videos of people riding bikes. That gives you the idea, shows you what you have to achieve, but then you have to actually get out there and ride the bike yourself. So go ride the bike, pause the video, go do this hands-on exercise, and now what are we going to do? We're going to show them the solution. Yeah. <laughs> so here's the solution. The first thing is, at the package level scope, using the var keyword, create a variable with the identifier y. The variable should be of the underlying type of your custom type x. So we're building on the code from the previous example. And at the package level, we want a variable. And the variable is going to be y, and it's going to be int, which is the underlying type of the custom type. The custom type was hot dog. The underlying type is int. Now we have y, variable y, and the underlying type is int. Cool. And now we've already done all that. That's from the previous exercise. Now do this. Use conversion to convert the type of the value stored in x to the underlying type. Then use the short declaration operator to assign that value to y. Print out the value stored in y. And then format print out the type of y. There we go. So I just added those in. You do not get docked down for not knowing that if you did it yourself, because I just added it. You probably hit that error that y was an unused variable. So now we are going to assign to y using the short declaration operator, and then use conversion to convert x, which is of type hot dog. x is of type hot dog. We're going to convert that to type int, the underlying type. And we did the conversion right here like that. And we assigned it to y. And now we're going to print out the value stored in y, and we're going to print out the type of y. I think that's all correct. Oh! Because you uh, redeclared a new variable. Barnabas is pointing something out here that we have to add in because I made a little bit of a mistake. I did short declaration operator, which redeclares a new variable. And so maybe if uh, we, yeah. So what we really wanted there was just the equal sign, which is assignment. So I'm modifying that code and that's the fix. And some of you probably saw it when I did it. And that's why it's good to have somebody as your right hand person uh, flying co-pilot with you because they catch they catch those errors. Good catch. This is pair programming at its finest. <laughs>